Adam B. here at the Kraft Music Gallery. Here at Kraft Music, we've been fans of the LX Series Digital Pianos by Roland for some time. Particularly happy today to be talking to you about the latest additions to the LX Series, the LX5, the LX6, and the flagship LX9. Let's take a deeper dive into these new LX Series pianos. Each of the three new LX pianos have the basic, upright, classic shape, but at three different heights. On the LX5, you're at 41 inches. On the LX6, you're at 44 inches. And on the flagship LX9, you're at 48 inches tall. And it's a remarkable look. It takes up most of the wall, and when you approach the instrument, you really feel like you're sitting at something special. Well, and you truly are, because the sound and the feel of the LX pianos are remarkable. Aesthetically, Roland has made some upgrades from the classic gold or brass hardware to a really nice silver hardware. You'll, you'll see that in the pedals, and it's sharp. As far as the finishes, you'll see that the LX9 comes in the charcoal, which is the piano sitting here with me, but also in a polished ebony and a polished white. LX6 is available in the polished ebony, which you see here to my right, but also in a charcoal and a rosewood. The LX5 is available in a polished ebony, a charcoal, a rosewood, or in the light oak, as you see here with me today. Each of the LX pianos comes to you with a matching bench. The LX9 features a soft closing key cover, while the LX5 and the LX6 have a sliding key cover. A feature that I really like about these LX pianos is that when you open that key cover, the piano automatically turns itself on. And when you're all done playing, simply close the cover, get on with your day, the piano automatically turns itself off. Pretty cool feature. When you open up the key cover and the piano turns itself on, you'll see that the dashboard of the instrument lights up, and that's all of your options to change sounds, to engage the metronome, and what have you. So it's real easy to interact with the instrument. If you don't like to see those lights when you're playing, it's real easy to just turn them off. So where do the sounds come from in your Roland LX digital piano? Well, Roland has a technology they refer to as piano reality. They model grand pianos, and it's beautiful. There's some key benefits to a modeled piano over a more conventional sampled piano. The two key benefits are, well, one, the decay of your note is very long and very natural. The other key benefit is that polyphony is limitless. I know, what's polyphony, right? That's how many notes you can play all at once. Well, I've only got the 10 fingers, so what's the deal? Well, if you're holding down a sustain pedal and playing, you're gonna play a lot of notes. Sampled pianos have a limit to that. Could be 64 notes, could be 127 notes, but on the Roland LX, it's limitless, just like an acoustic piano. Equally as important as the sound source is the key action. LX9 and LX6 feature the hybrid grand PHA 100 key action. LX9 with the haptic vibration, it's pretty cool. You can feel the vibrations under your fingers even when you're playing at low volumes or in headphones, so it makes for a very realistic experience. LX6 has the PHA 100 grand hybrid action without the haptic vibration. LX5 has that classic PHA 50 action that we've all known and loved for many years. The high precision sensing technology that Roland has in the new LX series pianos is really fantastic. Check this out. We were in a room with the LX9 we turned the volume all the way up, and we played at the most gentle, most delicate pianissimo you could imagine. And then we played at the most bombastic fortissimo you possibly could. And the piano responded very well. It was remarkable. The, this, this mammoth dynamic range that you can achieve with the LX piano. Let me play that for you right now. And what you're listening for is one, the dynamic range that I'm gonna build, and then two, the long decay when I finish. So we've discussed the key action, how they differ amongst the three models. Well, there's also a difference in the speaker systems amongst the three models. The 
the LX9 being the tallest instrument, it's really great that it's so, such a big instrument because it can house a whopping eight speakers with a center channel. The sound is tremendous. It also has the opening lid to let even more sound in your room. So LX9 is gonna give you the biggest, baddest, beefiest tone to fill your whole home, church, or stage with sound. The LX6 is a bit different of a design. It does not have an opening lid. It does have five speakers loaded into it. And then the LX5 also does not have an opening lid, but it does have four speakers built in. And by the way, all three models feature not one, but two headphone ports, one quarter inch, one eighth inch. There's also an eighth inch input. Perhaps you've got some pre-recorded music on some other device. You can run that through the piano speaker systems. The piano is also equipped with line level, quarter inch left and right output. You're gonna use this for a couple reasons. One, if you're doing some direct recording, or two, if you're tapping into a larger speaker system, that's what those ports are for. The new LX series pianos are also equipped with a USB to host, to interact with your desktop or laptop computer, and USB to device, to store your recorded songs onto a flash drive. There are many common features we find today in, in digital pianos, and you're gonna find just about all those here in the new LX series of digital pianos. Things such as hundreds of sounds to choose from. In the new LX series, there's over 300 of them. So whether you're looking for pristine grand pianos, upright pianos, strings, organs, and so many others, they're loaded into the LX. Other features like creating a split, creating a layer, the ability to record yourself and listen to the playback. The piano also allows you to customize your grand piano tone. You can do this from the panel or from your tablet. The piano's got Bluetooth, so you can connect to your tablet wirelessly. Now let's take a closer look at the front panel of the LX. So here I am at the LX9, and we're gonna take a look at the panel and some of the things you can do right from the panel of the instrument. Like I said earlier, opening the key cover automatically turns the instrument off. Of course, you can manually turn it on and off with the power button. Next is my volume dial. Let's skip over there. We'll come back to this in just a sec. Uh, but the next thing we wanna look at is all of our sounds. So here are the icons for the different sound categories, grand pianos, electric pianos, strings, and, and several other things. So right now I'm in the grand piano category. And then with my plus and minus area, I can scroll through the various different grand piano sounds. Head on over, these are upright pianos, and they're beautiful as well. Several of those in there. Uh, some electric pianos, and then you get into your strings and, and more, and so much more. So that's how you select tones right from the face of the instrument. You've also got a built-in metronome. And of course, you can control your tempo and all, all the standard things you would expect. You can set up your recording and your splits and your layers and your two hands mode, all from the panel here. And then you can go deeper into the instrument and change things like ambience. Ambience refers to the virtual room you're in. Right now I'm in a concert hall. And then I can control how much of that I want. If I wanna sound like I'm in a great big room or a very small room, I can do all that here. And here I can change things like the key off noise, the lid position, hammer noise, duplex scale. There's a variety of nuances you can change to create your own custom tone. Cabinet resonance, soundboard type, damper modeling. It's very robust. Now, you can change all this from the panel of the instrument, but also with the Roland Piano app, you can perform all these changes on your tablet or your iPad. Now, let's take a look at that. So here I am with my iPad and the Roland Piano app, and I am paired with the LX9, and everything that I showed you on the panel, you can do right here from the app. But the one thing I really wanted to get into on the app was the Piano Designer. And this is where you're gonna find all your, basically your virtual technician tools. Here they are, the lid open or closed, uh, mimicking the opening and closing of a physical lid on a grand piano, cabinet resonance, soundboard type, hammer noise, hammer response, damper modeling, soft pedaling, your tuning, and your temperament, and, and so much more. So you, when you look at all these parameters, you come to understand that you really can create the most ideal tone that you prefer, that rings best to your ears. You can create your own custom piano tone, and then you can save it and restore it every time that you sit to play. That's the Roland Piano app and the Piano Designer within the app.
So that's what's new in the LX series from Roland. The LX9, the LX6, and the LX5. LX9 with the haptic vibration, the eight speaker system with the center channel and the flip top lid, the new sound source, the unlimited polyphony, the long slow decay on all three models. These are really beautiful instruments. Your technique, your expression is virtually limitless on these instruments. They're truly magnificent. If you have questions about any of these LX pianos or any of the products we carry at Kraft, we hope that you'll reach out and contact us. Once again, I'm Adam B. here at Kraft Music. Thanks for watching.